What's going on guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be covering three different tips to help you improve at sniping. If you're wondering, what could this 29 year old Fortnite boomer possibly teach me about sniping? Roll the clip. Imagine, for the win. Oh my god the first tip that i want to cover is finding your sensitivity all you have to do is go into your settings and since i'm on mouse and keyboard i'm going to select that uh, and you'll notice it brings up all the sensitivity options here on the left side the scope sensitivity is when you're actually aiming down the sniper rifle scope i would recommend practicing with this get a sniper rifle and adjust your scope sensitivity and see what feels comfortable based off your aim if you notice yourself falling behind your targets when you're aiming then you probably need to increase your sensitivity by a little bit i would recommend going up by small percentages to avoid overcompensating one of the best things you can do to improve your aiming sensitivity is actually going to red versus blue. It's going to help you get comfortable with your new aiming sensitivity and it's also going to let you know if you need to increase or decrease your sensitivity based off how you're aiming. This brings us to tip number two, shoot your shot. I see so many people that are just scared to miss and it's so crucial to getting better with the sniper when you do miss. As someone wise once said, you miss 100% of the shots you don't take. You see, the more sniper shots that you miss, the better understanding you're going to get of where to place your next shot. Every time you're missing, you're learning how to adjust your aim and how to lead your target. Learning how to lead your targets is important because in some situations like this one here, I had to lead by a decent amount. This player was about 170 meters out, so I knew that I had to lead by this much because of how many times I've missed that shot. And finally, moving on to tip number three, we're going to be talking about centering your aim. Imagine I'm running around the map right now and I run up on these enemies. As you can see, my crosshair is right below their feet, so I'm definitely not ready to take this fight. I'm going to have to aim in and then move my cursor. Centering your aim is when you're looking around the map you want to be keeping it towards where enemies could be. So for example, if I'm running around, I'm always keeping my crosshair about head level. That way I'm ready to take on any fight that comes my way. When I'm playing, I'm typically running with a sniper. And if you notice, there's actually no crosshair on the sniper. Compared to the other guns, the AR has it, the shotgun has it, and the SMG has it. The center of my crosshair right now is on his head. And as soon as I aim down the sight, it's still there. But since the sniper doesn't have one, you kind of have to just know where it is, which can be difficult. I'm just gonna cover my cursor with a pink dot to show you guys as an example of how this works. Sniper rifle didn't have one, but now that I added it, you can see that it's still there. And as soon as I aim down the sights, my cursor and my crosshair is right on his forehead. A lot of times I'm running around the map with my sniper and I see a lot of people that run around like this. If someone starts shooting at you, you're aiming down nowhere close to where the players are at. Try running with your head up and that way whenever someone does shoot at you, you're ready to take the fight. I promise you centering your aim is going to change your fights. If I'm on a corner here and I'm going to go for a snipe, I have the advantage when I peek because I'm already going to be lined up with the player. A lot of times when players peek, they'll be here and they'll have to do this and adjust their aim. But if you if you understand where the crosshair is going to be as you peek, then you have an advantage on the fight. So the three topics we covered today was finding your sensitivity, shooting your shot, don't be afraid to miss, and centering your aim. I promise you, if you focus on those three things, you are going to improve at sniping so much. Can't wait to look back at some of the comments because I know some of y'all are gonna apply these tips and absolutely destroy some lobbies. If this video helped you, make sure to smack that sub button, baby.